Hello, this is Pastor. We're here finally at day five or lesson five of our virtual vacation Bible school. We hope you enjoyed it, learned a lot, and really grown a lot in your faith. That's a wonderful journey that we've been taking through some of Jesus' most wonderful statements and teachings for us. Today, kind of the climax is where we get to hear about Jesus as the living bread, the bread from heaven. Now, if we remember our Old Testament stories where uh, God, through Yahweh, the I Am, which is the pre-incarnate Jesus, fed the people bread from heaven and quail from heaven out of nothing in the desert and kept them alive for those 40 years. For us, we have a different kind of living bread. We have the living bread in Jesus himself, as he has taught us that I am the bread that came down from heaven. Whoever feasts on me shall never perish. Those of us who are confirmed in the church and in the faith, we get to come forward and we get to see the living bread and the living blood of Christ found in the cup and in the ciborium, and we get to partake in them. And it's a wonderful, wonderful gift. Uh, so as we go through confirmation with some of you in this year and a few years to come, we rejoice in the opportunity to finally come and take that great gift with your family and the whole host of heaven. So today, as you're finalizing your crafts and your projects, so enjoy them and rejoice in that living bread, which is Jesus, because it truly does bring eternal life and forgiveness of sins and all the great gifts that Jesus promises us to it through him. So let us pray uh, this uh, closing moment and uh, get off to the rest of the project. We pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this great week that we've had together. Uh, though we are doing it uh, distantly this year, uh, you have continued to teach us and to reach out to us so that we may grow in our faith and be strengthened in you, so that one day that when the judgment call is called, we will stand before you proudly and joyfully as you have brought us home to you. We ask you to continue to send us the living bread from heaven, which is your Son, Jesus Christ. Help keep him in our hearts to abide in our lives and lift us up, especially in some days which are dark and sorrowful. And we ask you to build us up in peace and joy this day and always. In Jesus' precious name, amen. So, Lily and Abby, thank you so much for helping me with all the activities. I'm so glad that you could help us. What are we making today? Muffins. Right. And why are we making muffins? Do you remember? Because it's like, yeah, Jesus is the bread. Yeah, today we learned where Jesus said, I am the bread of life. So we're going to make muffins to help us remember that. And these muffins are really easy to make. You only need water or milk. These ones need milk, and so follow the directions on the back to make them. Do you want blueberry or chocolate chip? Thank you so much for joining me this week and helping me out with these crafts and activities. I hope you have had a great time uh, going through the I Am statements of Jesus in John, learning about how Jesus is the light, Jesus is the bread of life, Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life, uh, Jesus is the shepherd, and Jesus is the vine. Enjoy, and we would love to see pictures of what you did at home with your house. Bye! Bye.